Long before the days of miserable cybernetic GTO robots 24 tabling microstakes for rake back, the poker landscape was a beautiful place. It was a simpler time, most would say, a better time. On September 24, 2003, U.S. Congressman James Moran's son, Jimmy, logged onto poker stars. He was hopeful that today would finally be his debut as a full-time poker pro. Jimmy then proceeded to register for a single $3.30 1K guaranteed tournament. This is his story. Right now, out of 498 players, I'm all the way down in 486. Ten minutes ago, I was in the top 20. So that's how that's how far I can. Wow. Okay. Well, I'm gonna call him, and I'm I'm in a lot of trouble here if I lose this hand. I see. Who? Yeah! That's what I'm talking about, baby. Who do you think you are? I am. Huge hand. What a huge hand! Are you kidding me? I just won 3,000. Remember when I said I was in 486 out of 400 and at 465th out of 486? Now I'm in 75th place. That's what I'm talking about, baby. Whoa! Oh yeah! Oh baby! It was the kind of day that most men can only dream of. Jimmy was on the road to a massive score. He could almost taste it. However, it was only level two, and there was still a long journey ahead. A journey fraught with many triumphs and glory. Making that raise and showing cards comes in handy. Because now I can raise and they'll think, well, he's just doing the same thing that he did before, but this time he doesn't have anything. So let's hope somebody calls me here. So obviously we're hoping no ace, no king on the flop, and we're hoping this guy has a pair of jacks or something. Okay, so now we flop the nuts. We want to check it, hope this aggressive player will try to muscle me out of it. Let's see what he does. Now. Although he, there are certain tells. You can't be like all loosey goosey having a sandwich, being on your phone. Woohoo, baby! I love it. You have to wait because you. I'm requesting time like I have to think about it. And now I'm calling. Okay. Jack, let's see what he does now. Let's see if he picks up on that bluff. Now 300. He did. Now I'm going to raise to 600. Okay, now I'm going to bet 490 to make it irresistible pot up. Actually, I'm going to bet 590. See what he does. I beat him. I have nuts. Done! I worked that guy! I worked you! I worked you! I worked you! thought I was being a wuss, but I had the nuts the whole time. That's what time it is. You gotta watch, because that's what time it is. Now it's time for me to fold, because I got 9-4. He called me. He called me. If, unless he has pocket sixes, I'm in, I'm, I'm in gold. What is this guy going to do? I'm, I, I'm hoping that guy has aces. Oh. All three of them are all in. Okay, oh. we got to avoid a set. No three, no eight. No three, no eight. Yes! There, Doc. Oh my God! Okay, it's happening. Everybody, stay calm. What's the procedure, stay everyone? Calm. Oh my God! You have got to be kidding me! Full house, baby! Unbelievable! You are in first position. I am leading the tournament, baby. You have got to be kidding me! And that's why you play five eight in the big blind. When the raise is only double your big blind. Unfortunately for us all, that is where the archived footage cuts off. But I have incredible news. 
According to Sharkscope.com, Jimmy Moran went on to finish in 127th position for a whopping $6.18. A huge day for both his bankroll and his self-esteem. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe, or you will never have big wins like Jimmy.